Hi, and welcome to the Rindy Ray channel. Today, I'm going to be talking about how I did my makeup. Just to show you a close up, here's what my eye colors look like. Signs of my faces. I'm going to show you the products I used. So, we are going to start with the first thing I put on is a moisturizer. I'm going to put my glasses on even though I do know the products. I actually tried the La La Retro Whipped Cream by, by uh, Drunk Elephant. I love that name. That is so cute. So this was a sample size. It's plenty. And I found out I have two of these. So I put a moisturizer on. Of course, I washed my face first. And then the primer I used, I had a sample, and I rarely use my sample, so I said, let me try this Cover FX Illuminating Primer Base. So it's just a little sample. And the full size is a one ounce size for $38. It provides an instant luminous glow, improves skin tone and clarity. So we shall see, right? I've had this on for a few hours now. The next thing I put on was I've been using Makeup Forever. I have a, a few different um, foundations I use. This is a liquid, and it's the Ultra HD Invisible Cover Foundation. My, my color is R330. It has a pump, and I put it on with a beauty blender. But for some reason, I don't know, my face has been breaking out. One, two, three, four. On the side over here, five. So it's been breaking out a lot. And um, it was last night, just to interrupt what I've been using, I tried the Coors Wild Rose. These breakouts were already there, so it didn't break out my face. And I showed this product, which I believe... I think this came in my Allure box. When I put it on last night and sleep with it, it's it's like a clear mask, like a gel form. And I could smell the roses for a little bit and then the smell wore off. And uh, so far, so good. So we'll try it again tonight until we use it up. I'm going to try to start using some of these products I got. Also, in um, that last video... Was this Birch Box? I'm starting to like which ones are these and I think it was Birch Box Box. The Daily Con Daily Concepts, your facial mini scrubber. So that scrubber was a little cloth scrubber. And um you couldn't see it too clear in the picture. It's a it's it's a travel size one and I thought it was a full size one, so it's a travel size one. And um you, you put your hands in, it's like a tiny mitt. Like, I would do three fingers. Four fingers were a little big. Okay, what else did we use? Okay, for the eyeshadow, I'm going to show you this kit. This was last year's Holiday Tarte gift set. Well, at least one of them. It came in this box. And I... Oops, this way. This way. And I haven't used it much, so it was called Tar Works of Tar Holiday 2016. I thought today I would use it since I haven't used it much. I think it was $59, and I wouldn't think it would be still available because the new holiday sets are out this year with a different design. And when you open it, you get all these wonderful shadows and a blush some bronzers and a highlight and then you open this little mirror and you see you get a little paint that's um not an eye it's like it's an eyeliner the kind with a brush and a mascara so the colors i put on today are for the all over i did the pearl earring and then I did on um, the eyelid, I did first, first impressions. 
And in the crease, I did Starry Night, which is dark blue. So I, I did the blues. I'm in the blue today. But I'm not blue. And, um, oh, this, it's called So Fine. And it was black micro liner eyeliner so it has a nice little brush oh. nice little brush not that great the eyeliner the uh it's a gla oh this is a glossy lip paint i did not put this on i have to rub it on my hand for my hair show you the color You can see it is it has some pink in it, pinky beige, very different looking, but it does have that gloss feel to it, which I used to like gloss. I don't know what happened. All of a sudden, I don't like gloss. So for the blush, I did use the Moment. This is Moment, this color, and I used the Unique bronzer. It has some sparkle in it. I don't see sparkle on my face though. And I use the highlighter which is called Authentic. So this comes with a lot of nice colors and I'm not sure if, if they ever repeat the colors. Like I have other Tarte, Tarte um, eyeshadow kits and I never looked to see if anything was repeated. I know I asked them to art themselves on Twitter if the uh, new toast palette was new colors and they told me it was new colors. I don't have it. I'm not sure if I'm ordering it or not. So I most likely won't be ordering the Tarte set this year because I don't know. I already have it. And what I did is I pulled up Tarte. Tarte, Tarte, Tarte to show you the collection. We are getting ready to unbox all of this holiday. This is what this that's launching. If you can see, uh, it's a little light. Um, it's Jen and Deanna, and we are getting ready to do our holiday this unboxing week. part three. Part three. Lots, <laughs> and lots, lots of holiday. Uh, Here, you can see what... Beauty. What the box looks yeah, like so this, this year. My favorites, the treasure box. So this it's is like their palette, well, one like of the, the holiday palettes like, for 2017. Like, what's in here? So, in here, ah, we have... Spin it, spin it, because I want to see the mirror. look at the mirror, I know. Look at that. Full mirror over here. Lights, camera, lashes, and deluxe. A deluxe TARDIS lip paint. A sex kit and liner. It's like a makeup. All of these shadows, look at these. I'm not going to count them because clearly I have trouble counting. I'll do it. There's <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six. There's 24. Oh, look at you. Math whiz. Then you have two bronzers over here. You have a matte and a shimmer. Ooh. You have a highlighter and then two blushes as well. These are so darn pretty. Touch that. I want this one. That one's okay. bizarre. I'm going to, because it's mm -hmm. bizarre. Let me see. So that's Let me one of the sets. I know there's a few. We'll get back to that in a minute. So let me see. What else did I use? On top, I put... I've been doing this. It's by Revlon. They're Photo Ready Eye Art. And they have two colors. They have this white... Let's see what they're called. It's a lid and line and lash. Black Brilliance and... Shadow is ombre. Sparkle. I don't know. They both have sparkle in them. So I put over the blue some of this white. Just like that. Looks light, but it has, some sp it has sparkle in it. Let me get more because it's hard to tell. Yeah. We're going to do it on this. Okay. 
if you can see it. I put it on top of my shadow. I didn't line my eyes with it. Then I curled my eyebrows with the Tarte eyebrow thingy. I have such a hard time. One side comes out so much better than the other side. But this was not last year's design. This was the year before. So 2016. 2015. Isn't that pretty? I think last year's was pink. I just thought this was so pretty. Jazzy and glittery. What else did I use? I used an, um, for mascara, which I got this in, I want to say my, a glossy box, I think. Juice Beauty Mascara. And the eyebrows, which I have so I didn't have good luck. If I can see this one, not good. I, I'm just some days the eyebrows come out, and other days they don't. I'm just so bad. This is Mac Lingering. We did get this recently in a Boxy Charm box, but I also have been using it for years now. I have quite a few of these same color and lingering. I do use. I have plenty of other eyebrow pencils because I've been trying everything. Then a little while ago, I took the Cub Brow Benefit and I have number two, Cream Gel Brow. I think everybody knows this product. It's cool because you just take the lid, put this over it, open the jar, put it on here, and you're on your way. I think I got one in a set, I want to say. I think I got a set. Then what else did I use? Oh, the lips, the lips. It's MAC lipstick. And it's, I believe, one of the limited colors. This is a satin lipstick in CC Me. And I forgot. I know somebody out there will know which limited product this was. It was it wasn't too long ago. I just forgot. I always have different people do different designs for them. I thought that was pretty. So that's the color. And that is it. Now I thought I had the paper with me but I memorized it anyway. I thought I'd do a tip of the day on my videos. I don't need my glasses anymore for this. I love First Magazine, and they have so many tips in it. And I was going through them, pulling out different things that I thought would be interesting. One tip I found is if you have an old book, you know how sometimes old books smell? They get nasty. It says to take a used dryer sheet and put them in between a page, and, and uh, the book's going to come out smelling great. So I'm going to try that and see if that works. I don't even use dryer sheets, so I'm going to have to actually go out and buy dryer sheets. Oh, yes, and I did use an eyeliner, and I can't remember which eyeliner it was also. So um, that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Please come back. Please click on the like button down below, the subscribe button. Leave a comment and let me know how I'm doing or if you have any questions or any kind of videos you would like me to do because I have tons of things. I have tons and tons of makeup, purse, pocketbooks, uh, different collections, all kinds of things. I've been thinking of ideas. So I'd love to do it for you. And also, if you want to get notified when I have a video, also hit that bell. So ring the Rindy Ray bell and you'll get notified. Thanks so much for watching. Always be safe and have a great day. Bye.